Hey guys, it's Jana Williams and welcome to another installment of Stay Inspired. So today we're just working in the office um, and I noticed how beautiful the, the window light was and it made me think that maybe we should do a, a video on window light. And if the mockingbirds won't sing Window light is so beautiful and um, I use window light at weddings when my bride is getting ready whether she's getting her makeup done or her mom is zipping her dress. Okay so the first thing I'm going to shoot is just these flowers. They're just in front of the window and they look really really pretty. And the, the, the tip I want to give you today is that my two favorite shutter speeds when I'm shooting uh, window light is 60 and 125. Okay so I try to get my shutter speed there like I said it, this may not be technically correct, but this is what I've found through experience that works the best, in my opinion. So then I um, set my ISO and my aperture, you know, I kind of like fix that according to um, what my shutter speed, what I want that to be. So um, I have my ISO at 320, so it's 320 ISO. I have my aperture at 2.0 and I have my shutter speed at 60. Now when you look through your camera, it's going to be like, whoa, it's going to say it's overexposed. The, the meter is going to be like way up, right? Yeah, my meter is like off the charts right now, but I can't wait to show you the picture with no editing. I'm not going to edit this. It's like, it's just really, really, really pretty. So the next thing I'm going to show you how to shoot is people in front of a window. So this is June, you've met her, she's my stepdaughter, and her Hi. friend Soshi, and they're really cool, talented, they love to do photography and draw, and they're cool fashion girls. So um, anyway, I have asked them to be my subjects in front of this beautiful window light. Cause I was made for loving you. Like I said before, I want to keep my shutter speed at 60 or 125. Whenever I'm at window light, that is my priority, is keeping my shutter speed at 60 or 125. So, um, um, so I did have to change my aperture and I have to change my ISO in here because now I'm shooting two girls instead of one flower. So I'm going to go download some of these um, images right now and show you and I hope that tip helps because I know that it helps me like when I'm on a wedding or, or something I just know that my go-to is 60 or 125 and it really makes that light wrap around. So thanks Soshi and June for being my models in Bugsy and Puma and don't forget to um, check out Jana's blog for <laughs> Instagram. Uh, connect me on Facebook and Twitter. Yeah. So thanks so much you guys. See you next time. Bye. Bye. If you lived across the sea I'd ask the wind to carry me And if the stars forget to shine I'll climb a ladder